Hello YouTube, Pilot Wannabe here, and we're on the ground at the Avalon Airport on Santa Catalina Island, and we are doing the I-8 exam on Pilot Edge today, going to San Diego's Lindbergh Field. Alright, I've filed my flight plan, and what we need to do now is jump in the aircraft, set her up, get the uh, clearance, and, um, and uh, taxi. So let's jump in the cockpit and uh, get going. SoCal Approach, Legacy 316 Papa Whiskey. That's another five Delta turn the left heading 330. Legacy 316 Papa Whiskey, SoCal Approach. SoCal Approach, Legacy 316 Papa Whiskey, looking to pick up the IFR to San Diego Lindbergh for the I-8. That's an IFR Delta Flight in 240. R6 Papa Whiskey, clearance from request. Okay, so our plan is on request, or something of that nature. We need to wait for him to get back to us. So I am ready to copy, as they say. Our 3165 Whiskey, clear from Santa Catalina Airport to San Diego Lindbergh Airport as filed. Maintain 4,000. Expect 5,000 when they're missed departure. Departure frequency 127.4.2036. Hold for release. Clear to San Diego's Lindbergh Field as filed. Uh, up to 4,000, 5,000, and 10 minutes. Departure frequency 127.4, squawk 2036, and hold for release for 6 Papa Whiskey. Number 6 Papa Whiskey, read back, correct, hold, uh, advise, ready for departure. Ready for departure, time now, 6 Papa Whiskey. Are you ready for departure now? Affirmative, 6 Papa Whiskey. Our 6 5 Whiskey release for departure clearance for it is now off by 2128, time now 2123. Okay, no. void if not off by 2128, uh, time is now 2121, um, 6 Pop Whiskey. 2123 is, is time now, 2123, frequency change approved. Frequency change approved, 6 Pop Whiskey. So Alright, so we are good to go. Alright, let's get in our squawk code before we bugger that up. 2036. Altitude reporting is on. And uh, frequency change approved. So let's go to uh, uh, CTAF here which is, just to double check, 122.7, and I think that's what we got, 122.7. Good. Avalon traffic, legacy, 316 Papa Whiskey's taxing to runway 22 for departure to the east. Six Papa Whiskey. Hmm, Should have ended that with Avalon traffic. Anyway, um, Let's see here. Uh, Traffic. Landing lights can come on. And uh, let's look to our left, look to our right, and we're clear. Let's give it a little juice. Okay, let's get our checklist active. Engine run up. So parking brake set. Throttle to 1500 RPM.
Okay, and uh, okay. slight drop. That is slight drop. And exercise the prop. And the prop governor is holding the RPM. What the hell was that? <laughs> Happened to me on the last test, too. All right. And back to idle. And we're golden. All right. Let's take a look. Doesn't seem to be anybody in the pattern. Okay. Avalon traffic. Legacy 316 Papa Whiskey is taking off runway 22 for departure to the east. Avalon traffic. Okay, we've got two minutes to get in the air. And no helicopters or private jets coming. It's good. Alright, so one notch of flaps. Got lots of power here. Alright, bringing up power and we are rolling. speed and our nose is up positive rate gear up Traffic. what the hell was that nine o'clock two miles okay all right let's bring back the power to about 24 Traffic. And we are at 2,300 feet almost. All right, let's turn inbound. And let's, whoop. let's engage the autopilot. And heading mode. And let's swap frequencies here and give a listen. And flaps up. Roger that, give me one second. Contact. We're very Somewhere close to the VOR, so we are going to go on course and wait till we leave the Gona confusion, so to speak. Ever show three, two, go. You're wanting to go to the coast route right now? All right, three, two, go. Maintain VFR 6,500 outside Bravo airspace. Okay, we seem to have uh, passed over the VOR. SoCal departure, 316 Papa Whiskey, level. Oop. Forgot to arm the freaking autopilot. Jeez. 6295 Delta, SoCal departure, radar contact, mid approach procedure is approved. Um, Maintain VFR 3500. Okay. What the hell is with this thing? There we go. All right. Altitude four thousand. Control 
SoCal Departure, Legacy 316 Papa Whiskey, level 4000. Legacy 316 Papa Whiskey, SoCal Departure, right now. Okay, so to ident. There we go. Legacy 6 Papa Whiskey, radar contact, one zero miles east of Santa Catalina, VOR. Contact SoCal, climate team 5000, contact SoCal approach 128.1. Up to 5,000 and over to 128.1 uh, for 6 Papa Whiskey. Alright, so 5,000. Alright, and 28.1. Sure, who that is? 128.1. Oh, so called departure as well. So called departure, legacy 316 Papa Whiskey out of 4300 for 5000. Legacy 316 Papa Whiskey, so called approach, John Wayne, altimeter 299 or 8. Okay, and we apparently are on our way and doing well. So I'm going to switch this over to GPS here. Hope that nothing goes awry. Actually, I'll go to heading mode first, just to make sure. Alright, and then nav. During the cruise, max uh, cylinder head temperature is 420, so we're well below that. And this is our fuel flow here, 13.8 gallons per hour. And our speed is picking up, we're at uh, 226 over the indicated. Piper, November 7-3, Yankee Zulu at uh, 2 uh, Request in the LAX Bravo transition via the coastal route. 7-3, Yankee Zulu. Local departure. Uh, cancel out to restriction. Resume on navigation. Resume on navigation. 3, Yankee Zulu. 7-3, Yankee Zulu. You say you wanted to do the coastal route there. Uh, maintain VFR at 6,500 outside Bravo airspace. Until advised. Maintain 6,500 VFR, will, not, uh, will avoid Bravo airspace, uh, free Yankee Zulu. All right, looking good, looking good. So after takeoff checklist, Um, well, for 
forget the initial climb, cruise. Set power, mixture, lean, check battery condition. Two six here, Papa. Uh, clearance on the quest, was that your question? Okay, we're good. Okay, we are leaned, trimmed, good to go. Alright, so... 26 here, Papa, are you at Bakersfield Airport? Uh, if you're at Bakersfield Meadows, uh, that's a powered airport, uh, basically, when you look at that chart, if you see any tower facility, which is tower, ground, or clearance, that's who you call for clearance, because they're, they're local on the airport there, uh, and if, if not, they would let you know. Um, otherwise, you would call the, the radar facility above, which in that case would be Bakersfield Approach. Missing the boat on some things problem. here. There were six here, probably. That's affirmative, except just to be clear, you go for the lowest one on there, uh, lowest meaning clearance, ground, and then tower in that order if they're on the chart. In Bakersfield's case, uh, you, you should look on there and you'll see tower and ground, so you go to, go to ground. Sokal 79625 Delta, I'm at Seal Beach, the whole time 3500. So 6295 Delta, right? Okay, so we've got a little ways here. Alright, estimated time on route to our destination 13 minutes. Right, so let's start getting set up. Now, I want to make sure that um, we have our approach in. And localizer uh, 27 in San Diego. Okay, we got some traffic in our vicinity. None of them are within six miles worry about that. The inner circle is six miles. Official 3 go. Roger, you don't have to ask for that. The uh, uh, We'll never cut you loose. Okay, the whole thing is six uh, miles, so. Request it or we're right. sending you off to a tower or, uh, or uh, CTAP or advisory. So let's go to charts. So you don't have to ask for that. And we will get uh, San Diego. And the Approach, and we want localizer 27. Got 378 traffic. Nine o'clock, moving towards 10 o'clock. One mile, same direction out to the 4,600 okay. type, and I'll converge at uh, Fillmore there. So eight is there is 134.8. Uh, let's see what else. Ground what is, is one two three point nine. All right, and tower. Lindbergh Tower one one eight point three. That's four three Juliet. So we'll go stand by here. Well, actually, it's a little early. It's a little early for that. Probably gonna have a few uh, frequency changes before then. So we'll keep that in mind that it is 118.3. And I'm sure they will tell us as well. Alright. So I'm going to give the listen monitor uh, COM2, which should let us uh, listen in to uh, San Diego ATIS. Contact 
So we have the uh, weather. Okay. Also, I have my uh, four flight, which uh, can give me the weather pretty darn quick and easy as well. So according to floor right, flight, so wind is 310 at 9 knots, 10 miles visibility, a few clouds at 25,000, temperature 21, altimeter is 300. 3000 and but that's 51 minutes ago so it's a little dated Temperature 32 go SoCal approach leave Bravo airspace can't stop through restriction resume all navigation now tender 3 oh, now it's 299 or 8 Legacy 6 pop whiskey contact SoCal approach 119.6 SoCal approach 119.6 Six pop whiskey. Okay, one one niner, one six. Calder three seventy eight contact point with good approach one two four point seven. Just want to make sure. So Cal departure, right? So Cal departure, legacy three one six pop of whiskey level five thousand. TVM 213 Charlie Whiskey, SoCal departure, can't stop the restrictions on navigation. Okay, we're just passing over uh, Oceanside now. Alright, 316 Pop Whiskey, SoCal approach, out to 2998. Advise you have Lindbergh weather report request. I have the weather, and in San Diego, I'd like the localizer 27 approach, 6 Pop Whiskey. Suddenly, it got dark in here. Delta 905 Delta Roger, fighting 070. Maintain VFR at all times. Delta Shell 32 Gulf, maintain VFR at uh, 900,500 outside Bravo Airspace. So you want the, the Coliseum uh, uh, back through? are in the clouds, and we just popped out of that one. Right. Three, three, two, go. Thanks. Roger that. Uh, think can be a nine thousand five hundred. I wonder if that's the nuclear power plant. Center, that is a nuclear power plant. It is a visual reporting plant. Point. So we have to bear in mind this aircraft is slippery. We have to slow down early and uh, do whatever we have to to get her under control so we can have a nice, smooth touchdown. So I suspect uh, when we get to Mission Bay, he will give us a heading to depart on, probably 090 or 070 or something of that nature, and set us up for the downwind into San Diego. I'm going to set up tower here. One one eight. Okay, we're still three two off the so three. K sand tower. So it's set, tuned and identified. And also what's that? I'm not sure. So let us go here. And inbound course is going to be 
272. Well, let's check to make sure localizer runway 27 in San Diego. Yep. And inbound course is 272. And localizer is 110.9. So that's 9 5 Delta Flight 806 here. Keep going 3 Charlie Whiskey, contact SoCal approach 135.4. And it is code I U E R. I U B R. Hmm. Interesting. U B R. One ten point nine, one ten point nine. All right, little discrepancy there, but I'm confident we have it. What's your destination and planned altitude? So I'm going to put 110.9 in the uh, nav two. I'm going to dial in 272. Earth three Charlie Whiskey. Um, 12 one more. You got to maintain appropriate view for altitude to be uh, eastbound odd. Plus five for VFR, so uh, probably thirteen five or eleven five, but uh, maintain VFR at or below nine thousand five hundred for now. Right, three Charlie Whiskey, Roger. That'll be at or below nine thousand five hundred. Three, two, go up, so kind of yeah, you didn't say anything. You just called me. I didn't, I didn't get anything from you. Um, go ahead. Three, two, go up. Uh, when you when you switch to a new frequency, you gotta you make your check in. You gotta you say your at least your call sign and your altitude. Um, so I'll need your altitude. I need you to say your altitude. Commercial three two well, thank you. You cleared to Los Angeles proper airspace. The Coliseum route south now maintain via four nine thousand five hundred. Right. We're getting close, and we haven't gotten instructions yet. To Mission Bay. Lexi 6, Papa Whiskey, flight 090, vector 50 approach, contact SoCal approach 124.35. SoCal approach 124.35 and fly heading 090. 2435. And then let's go heading. That's 95 Delta traffic, 1154 miles southbound on to the case 2500 type unknown. Okay. Good. SoCal Approach, Legacy 316 Pop Whiskey, level 5000. All right, let's start slowing this baby down. That has the field in sight. Galaxy 378, Point Magoo approach. Never heard you check in. Um, All right. Point Magoo out. So here we are, in 090, 090, 090, and we're on the downwind. And, uh, radio service, 7 minutes, squawk before. Please change approved. You contact contact. And there contact is San 4, Diego, 9, and traffic bound. Okay. We're looking at 13 below us, 5 below us, 5 below us. Okay, not a whole lot of separation, but it will have to do. All right, so let's uh, tune in the... Um, 
the localizer and 272 is our heading, our course. There we go. So we're almost precisely on the downwind. So we're currently six miles out from the uh, runway threshold, I guess. And we're probably going to be about 14 nautical miles before we get a turn, which would put us at Vida, which is way out here. Yeah, Vida is the initial fix. And Vida is at 14.2 miles. And it's at 4,000, as we can see there. Free Charlie Whiskey can cancel altitude restriction. All right, so we're at approximately 180 indicated. Let's bring that back some more. Let's go to 15 inches of uh, manifold pressure. Let's see what that does for us. thousand feet below us and five hundred feet below us. He's behind me a little bit. Don't see him. Okay. Speed now one sixty and coming down. Sliding two seven zero, maintaining VFR three thousand uh, to establish localizer clear, localizer DME, runway 24, practice approach. Okay. Things are looking good, but it's about to get busy, I think. I was looking for my uh, wet compass. There it is. Let's see how much time I have in this aircraft now. Nineteen and a half hours. Okay. Speed still coming down ever so gently. Still doing 153 knots. So I'm going to bring her down to 12 inches of manifold pressure. to think about speed early to slow this puppy down. Okay, at 132 knots in the white arc, we can drop gear or flaps, I think. Okay. Okay, coming up on 14 nautical miles out from the uh, airport, so we should get uh, vectors soon. We got another aircraft, 2,000 feet below us. There he is. It's about the earliest I've picked up uh, an aircraft. Usually I look and I don't see. Let's see if we can identify what it is. Looks like a Cessna. Alright, let's put back some power. Let's see if we can identify what it is. Looks like a Cessna. Alright, let's put Don't want our speed to decay right, anymore. And we are on V lock, but uh, let's activate the approach. R two six here, Papa. Um, yeah, he, he he let me know what was going on there. That's no problem. And the the departure is. Uh, do you have the chart? Or 
260 Papa Roger. Yeah, if you have the chart, you'll see it's just a radar vector departure to the to your first fix, which is San Marcos. So it's going to be radar vectors to San Marcos. So it's no big deal. All right. Apparently that mountain top is uh, yeah, you really just minimum safe altitude over there is 5,400 feet. You know, We're at 5,000. Identifiers. Our controller's a little busy. I expect he'll turn us imminently. Area 73 Yankee Zulu contact, SoCal approach 134.2. Pat went from 120 to 140, just like that. All right. Have to keep a sharp eye on that. SoCal Approach, Legacy 316 Papa Whiskey, level 5000. That was just to get his attention. Legacy 6 Papa Whiskey, that's affirmative. Turn right heading 180. Turn right heading 180, 6 Papa Whiskey. 573 Yankee Zulu. All right, one heading SoCal 180. Navigation, appropriate VFR altitude, Burbank altimeter 299 or 8. Direct south. Okay. There is somebody out there. It's in front of us now, 3,400 below us. All right, down to 120. Let's put back some power, but not too much. All right, let's uh, drop uh, one notch of flaps. Six Papa Whiskey, turn right heading two four zero. Right two four zero for Legacy Six Papa Whiskey. And let's go another notch of flaps. Keep that until we are um, much closer. Okay, we have not been cleared to approach yet. Lucy six pop whiskey, four miles from Vita, maintain four thousand until established on a published segment of the approach. Clear localizer right two seven approach. Cleared right to seven uh, approach and down to four thousand for Legacy Six Pop Whiskey. Okay, so we are cleared to approach. Nine hundred five Delta contact, Fullerton Tower, one one nine point one Sierra. Okay, and as we see here, we're pretty good track for Vida. And Vita is 4,000. Okay. Let's uh, increase that rate of descent. Two six zero Papa Rita contact well. TVM three Charlie Whiskey contact Los Angeles Center one two six point three five. Okay, so now's a good time to do our landing checklist, and we're going to arm the nav. All right, altimeter set, power set as required, landing. Ah, uh, mixture, we're going to go full on the mixture, full on the prop, and when we're below 132, we can drop the gear, and we're there already. Yeah, um, 213 Charlie Whiskey, Los Angeles Center, Daggett Altimeter 3008. Okay, let's go. We got all our lights on. Fuel boost can go on. Our 73 Yankee Zulu remain outside Van Nuys. All right, Delta coming up please. on Vida, I guess. Yep, 
we're at 4,000, and our speed is decaying. Let's get a little bit more power in there. And after Vida, it's down to 3,600. All right, we're at 14.2, down to 3,600. its thing. Okay. So at Okane is 12.2. So at 12.2, we're going to go down to 2,500. Control three two golf contact, so approach one point one. Oh come on. Five seven three Yankee Zulu, so call approach. I've been trying to reach you there, I'm not sure if you heard me. Remain outside, Van Nuys class Delta airspace. Okay, there we go. So we've passed 12.2 down to 2,500 now. Mm, there are three Yankees with a negative. You're above it. You're not inside it. You're above it. Um, the ceiling there is uh, 2,900. Capital 32 Golf. Uh, the frequency is 128.1. Right, we should be down by 8.7, and we're not descending very quickly. Arm, there we go. This autopilot is killing me. All right, we get the field in sight. Okay, by 8.7, should be at 2,500. All right. Uh, I need your call sign. I can't. I, did, I missed your call sign the first. Back time. off the power a little bit. Now we're gonna go third notch of flaps and gear down. All right. Show three two golf so cal approach. Even Bravo airspace cancel out the restriction. So we passed eight point uh, seven. It's down to two thousand now. Sorry, correction. Resume on navigation and appropriate vehicle altitude. All right, and so at 6.5 is the final approach fix, and we should be at 2,000 at 6.5. All right, uh, missed approach is, what is it? Missed approach, climb to 2,500 on runway heading, and then approach direct to uh, Mission Bay. Okay, we're coming up on 2,000, and we're not quite at uh, 6.5 yet. All right, and so from Plus Rebo at 6.5, from 29 Palms Airport to Vancouver, we're going to go visual. Uh, airfield. All right. So there's 6.5. Autopilot off. Yaw dampener off. One four thousand. Okay, One's final notch of flaps are in. Frequency 126.35, 125745, hold for release. All right. We want to be at 85 knots over the uh, runway, over the threshold. So, we'll try to keep it around 90 knots. We've got full flaps, One's gear down, machine, mixture, exactly. props. Gear down, mixture, props, and fuel Last is on both. Alright. Okay, I'm liking where we're at. Speed is good.
Or seven three Yankee Zulu, radar service terminated. Keep your squad code. Contact Santa Monica Tower one two zero point one zip. It's only one light, so we are low. So we'll add power because we are trimmed up nice. Six five whiskey contact number tower one eight point three. Over to tower one one eight point three for six pop whiskey. One eight point three. Lindbergh Tower, Legacy, 316 Papa Whiskey on the I on the localizer 27. Six Papa Whiskey. Six Papa Whiskey, still with some kind of approach, check your radio. Okay. 118.3. Legacy, Six Papa Whiskey, still here? Yeah, I'm tuned in 118.3 for Six Papa Whiskey. Yeah, I see that. Uh, okay, I can't land until I'm clear to land. I might have to do a go around. 500. Lindbergh Tower, Legacy 316 Papa Whiskey on the localizer 27. Legacy 6 Papa Whiskey, you still with uh, SoCal? There's a little frequency bug here. Uh, just go ahead and uh, go around. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Approach. Okay, we'll execute the missed approach as published. Six Papa Whiskey. All right, so smoothly power up. And when we indicate a positive rate, we'll bring up the gear. I see put Six Papa Whiskey. How's the visibility there? Visibility is fabulous. Six Papa Whiskey. Do you have the airport inside? I'm over the threshold now. Six Papa Whiskey. I know, but I have to I have to ask you. Uh, you have the airport in sight. Enter uh, uh, right traffic. Clear visit approach runway two seven. Contact tower. I should disregard the contact tower portion. We'll enter a uh, right traffic pattern. Clear to land two seven six pop whiskey. All right, so. Let's get to a thousand feet. I see six five whiskey as far as runway two seven you put on. Clear to land, runway two seven, six pop whiskey. Okay, Mike Charlie. Alright. So okay, direct Santa Monica climbing team four thousand. Hey, Alright, let's Monica, uh climbing to four thousand. Sorry, I Charlie. Turn crosswind. Okay. Six five whiskey. I'm not sure why that happened there. It happens occasionally to people when it's uh, something to do with the internet connection. But uh, when you get on the ground, you may have to disconnect and reconnect to, uh, to get a hold of uh, hold of the tower. All right. Affirmative. I will uh, check that uh, when I'm on the ground. Six pop whiskey. Okay. So let's looking okay. Let's turn. Downwind. Okay, we're at a thousand feet. Let's take out some power. Okay, so a little drama, but we are well prepared for it. All right. Let's get some trim down. So there's the runway. We're looking good. We're clear to land, but we're not a beam the numbers or anything like that yet. All right, so I'm going to go flaps three position. Try to get the trim all good. And a little too much. We'll lose an altitude. Okay. And we are beam the numbers, so we can commence our shallow descent. All right. 
There'll be hills here. All right, let's uh, turn base. So we're mindful of these hills. That might be the reason that uh, San Diego is one of the world's most dangerous airports or approaches, something like that. All right, we're on base looking good. Let's go final notch of flaps. Power back a little bit. Trip show three two golf, stay attention. We're a little high. So, call for a trip show three two golf, please. Uh, let's get land up. So, next. gear down, flaps down. All right, well, Torrance is, uh, you're flying away from Torrance. And let's get our speed back a little bit. To okay, we're over the wire now, apparently. All right, we're looking good, and we're at ninety knots. And our trim is all buggered. There we go. I'm liking where we are. Over the numbers. And power is out. And we're down. 94 feet per minute landing. All right. Flaps up, and we're going to exit to the right. Right, 1062, contact Los Angeles Center, 125.27. Good evening, 27, Los Angeles All righty, so here we are at Charlie 3, and we're going to hold here. Okay, parking brake set, and strobe lights off, landing lights off, fuel boost pump off, and let's disconnect and reconnect. Okay. Tower, Piper, November 7, 3, Yankee, Zulu, and I think uh, the switch is made. I'm hearing different conversation. Piper 7, 3, Yankee, Zulu, Hawk, there correction, Torrance Tower, Roger, and enter right downwind, runway 29 or right, reporting the field downwind. Right downwind, 29 or right, will report midfield downwind, 3 Yankee, Zulu. Lindbergh Tower, Legacy 316 Papa Whiskey, has vacated runway 27 at Charlie 3. Hmm. Enter 316 Papa Whiskey, Lindbergh, Grand Rod, Taxi Ramp via Charlie, and uh, good afternoon. Taxi parking via Charlie, and thank you, 6 Papa Whiskey. All right, so he didn't say anything about swapping to ground, so we shall not. Los Angeles. We're just gonna go straight ahead, park, and then inquire about our rating. One IFR to Las Vegas with Quebec. Okay, this is stock scenery, so I'm not gonna go to the uh, northern parking area because it's not modeled here. And I think the tower's in the wrong location. Midfield downwind for two nine or right. Five seven three Yankee Zulu runway two nine right. Clear to land. Clear to land two nine or right. Three Yankee Zulu. 
1251, Los Angeles Clearance, Quinto Las Vegas Airport, Loop Bay, departure, dash transition, the NASA file, Columbia State, 718, 5000, part 3215, 5.2, squawk 4773. All right, so, um, let's get everything off here. That was a fast one. Uh, Loop Bay, departure, and dagger transition, uh, then NASA file, Columbia State, 718, 5000, 125.2, mixture to cut off. 4773, the squawk, uh, American 1251. American 1251, we're back correct. I tell you what, if you told me back in December when I joined this company, I'd be able to say this stuff this fast. Heh. Yeah, no way. You guys are awesome. <laughs> All right. That's fantastic. Lindbergh Tower, Legacy 316 Pop Whiskey. Yes, I'd like to uh, inquire as to my rating, Six Pop Whiskey. Right there, Six Pop Whiskey, Roger, stand by on your test results. Think brilliant, beautiful sunshine there. Or, there we right go. There, six Pop Whiskey, congratulations, you are a pass on the, what is that, I-8, congratulations. Thank you very much, and we'll see you for the I-9, Six Pop Whiskey. All right, well, there you have it. It's a pass. Minor bit of drama with a technical glitch. Let me disconnect from uh, uh, Pilot Edge now. So, uh, a minor glitch. Uh, couldn't transfer over to uh, Tower properly, so did a go around, stayed in the pattern, and uh, put her down nice and smooth and gentle like. So, thank you for joining me on this I-8. It's a pass, and uh, stay tuned for the I-9, and uh, we'll see you then. Until then, Pilot Wannabe saying so long.